Hey there, it's Andrea from Doing Business As Yourself, and I just wanted to show you a quick video about how if you just take the time to do a little bit of keyword um, uh, home, housework, I guess I'd call it, um, instead of just sending your videos up, if you do a little bit of um, title and tag and description keyword uh, housework, uh, then you can actually end up in the top search for any for not for any phrase for phrases that have a certain um, ratio of search volume to competition score um, if you get this if you install the basic vidIQ tool if you land in the green or even in the middle of these two bars so search volume and competition score. So you want high search volume and a low competition. So fewer people that are optimized for a particular phrase. I found a video um, in my on my hard drive. It's a minute and a half and it retouch video was not the, the keyword. I wasn't thinking of any keyword when I made this video but I want to show you that matching a keyword that suits the video even after the fact, when I finally titled it and then did a little quick description, uh, what can happen? So I did this. I did this video, the, and then I found this keyword retouch video. 480 searches per month is what it says over here. Um, over here, I'm not even sure why it has this many um, searches. And it's interesting to see doing business as yourself as the top creator here because I am, I, I, I guess it's because I have it two times in the title, maybe. Anyway, so um, what I wanted to show you though was how quickly this can happen. So I did, I found this this um, keyword phrase that fits with, in con, you know, so the con context is right for the video even though it's maybe not right for the searchers so the people who are searching for this are searching for a solution for how to retouch video it's not what my video is about my video is here so it ended up as number four at the moment you can see that it was posted 57 minutes ago which is pretty quick I probably I didn't even think to look at it until before this minute so it could have been like an instant thing it could have been like you know 57 seconds in or whatever but anyway within the, an hour it was number four on that search and um, you can see that uh, it's not I'm not doing like so I'm not I don't have a software video it's not a software video the rest of these are software videos right so the chances of somebody watching mine on this one will we'll hinge completely on is this an interesting uh, headline so the way that I did it was my what this is is it a video of me sort of it was in between um, it was on I was fiddling with the software video conferencing software and they found a retouch button in there and someone had gone away to um, actually it was Barb if Barb's watching it was you you she went away to go do something real quick and then while I was waiting I just did this I shot this quick minute and a half video and left it on my desktop and it's just showing the difference between the t the retouch button and the non retouch button some thoughts about why I don't tend to put uh, filters and you know customized pictures and whatever and so I found it this morning and I thought well this is kind of funny and it's nice and short and let me find a keyword for it and so I've gone through the process of doing that keyword optimization stuff and lo and behold here it is number number four on the search how long it'll stay there I have no idea but the point is is that it it, it can be when you hit the right keywords you can shoot straight to the top of the first page of a search in a site as big as YouTube. It's pretty cool. And it works. Okay. So, um, yeah, that's all I wanted to show you. I hope you are inspired to persevere through learning how to do this and, and, um, 
you know, ticking the boxes that need ticking in order for the, the algorithms of the search engine to know what your videos are about so that they can be um, brought to the people who want to see them. Alrighty, have a good day. Talk to you later.